sea, lo venimos viendo día a día, ¿no? lo que el profe nos enseña. We've seen them uh, for a long time, mm. what our coach is teaching us about them. Oh. Venimos analizando sus puntos y, y ver cómo lo podemos confrontar. We are analyzing their, uh, their, their game mm. and to know and to learn how to mm -hmm. attack that. How do you enjoy adapt? How how adapt in Surabaya? How has been the adaptation in Surabaya? Very well. We are now adapting a little bit. The climate, as you know, we are coming from the altitude, so it can be difficult a little bit. We have had a very good preparation, mm -hmm. especially because we are coming from a high city, okay. so we are uh, adapting mm -hmm. every single day to the new place mm -hmm. we are. And the training also helps to get adapted. Okay. Eh, ¿Cómo se siente el equipo al saber que van a enfrentar un partido inaugural como lo fue en el año 2022 la selección mayor eh, contra Qatar? ¿Qué siente el equipo? Primero nos sentimos o sea, confiados porque lo conocemos de mismo. Como venimos haciendo una preparación en Arabia, eh, eso nos sirvió de experiencia para he said uh, how, how do you feel about the first game is going to be against the, the local team as it happened in Qatar and he says that he feels very good about it and uh, he have, we have worked a lot to uh, have this first game in the best way as possible do you think there's something special or unique in Indonesia maybe food or culture here piensas que hay algo exclusivo en Indonesia como la comida o la cultura acá Más que todo la cultura, diferente a Ecuador, eh, el clima. The weather and the culture is different uh, compared to Ecuador. Yeah. Eh, la adaptación de, de los jugadores y todo eso. And getting adapted to the new schedule, it's new for all of them. What about food? What about food? ¿Qué piensa de la comida de cada indonesia? Eh, Muy diferente a la, a la de Ecuador y adaptándonos a la comida aquí. Pretty different uh, comparing to our food, but we are adapting to the food too. In, in the match will be a lot of supporter in Indonesia. How the mentality against a lot of supporter like that? And, uh, like uh, a lot of people? Yeah, mean? a lot of people yeah, in the stadium. Yeah, a lot of people in the stadium. What does it mean to have a lot of people in the stadium? What does it mean to have a lot of people in the stadium? O sea, en la cancha ya se nos van a ir los nervios cuando ya suena el silbato y tocamos el primer balón. Mm -hmm. Y en la cancha vamos a hacer contra once y vamos a dar todo el uso. At the beginning we will be kind of nervous, but uh, with the first whistle we are being 11 against 11 and everything okay. will get better, yeah. you know, once okay. the game starts. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. One, 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 one. What do you start get uh, as individual and, and the team? Because uh, uh, Ecuador runner up in Copa America under 17. Oh, can you repeat the last part? Please? Uh, Ecuador is runner up uh, under 17 in South America, and maybe this this uh, uh, they are a favorite in Group A. What what we think and uh, what is target as an individual? Sí, ¿qué te has propuesto? ¿Cuál es tu objetivo individual? Considerando que los rivales del grupo A en el que le ha tocado para jugar. Los rivales que nos han tocado a nosotros son muy fuertes, como los Indonesia, Marruecos y Panamá. Entonces, de eso yo me vengo preparando este, físicamente, mentalmente también, para lo que se viene y lo que es con Ecuador, que ha cambiado. They are conscious that the, the teams that are, are in Group A are very strong, very hard, and it's going to be difficult for them. But he in by himself, he's thinking about uh, analyzing all the, the the games they are going to play with, and uh, he knows it's going to be okay because they are working hard to do it.